Watt resistance must be placed in parallel with a 155 ohm resistor to make the equivalent resistance be equal to 115 ohms. Let us first draw our circuit. So, let's say for example, this is our circuit. We have two resistors in parallel. parallel. So, Let's say this is R1 equal to 155 ohm. Then we are, this is R2, we are being asked for R2. So that the uh, R total is 115 ohms. So we are required to get uh, R2, the uh, resistor uh, parallel to R1. Now since this is a parallel circuit, from our equation for total resistance for parallel uh, circuits we have uh, 1 over R total is equal to 1 over R1 plus 1 over R2 so on and so forth it depends on how many resistors you have the circuits have so at this circuit we only have two resistors so the total resistance is just equal to the reciprocal of the resistor 1 and the resistor 2 so we have R total and we have R1 R total is 115 R1 is 155 so this is just uh, 1 over 115 ohms is equal to 1 over 155 ohms plus 1 over R2. So by just simplifying this uh, equation, we will have uh, this is R2, 155 R2 all over uh, 155 R2 divided by 155 is R2 times 1 this is R2 plus 155 this is 1 over 115 so by cross multiplication we will have uh, 155 R2 times 1 is equal to R2 plus 155 multiplied by 115 so this will just become 155 R2 is equal to 115 R2 plus 155 uh, times 115 times 115 this is 17825 then uh, we solve for R2 this is uh, 155 R2 minus 115 R2 is equal to 17825 155 minus uh, 115 is 40 R2 equal to uh, 17 8 to 5 divide this by 40 divide this also by 40 cancel R2 now 
is equal to 445.625 ohms so this is uh, the resistance of uh, the second resistor uh, 445.625 or approximately 446 ohms 